We have to briefly talk about uh, the vertebral venous plexus of Batson and the importance of this word venous plexus in understanding the spread of a prostatic malignancy. So this was another way that this question was twisted in this exam because normally they usually say just the vertebral venous of uh, venous plexus of Batson and its importance in the spread of disease generally. I don't know if you understand. So this one, they now what gave you a particular disease which should not be something that should confuse you, okay? So when they say there's a venous plexus, what does a venous plexus mean? A venous plexus simply means this vein is coming here, another one is coming, they are joining. Okay, they are forming like a network. Do you understand? So if veins are forming a network, all right, and if an infection eventually gets into one of the veins, it means that what? It will spread to the rest of the veins. I don't know if you understand. Making the infection spread faster. Another scenario could be like this. Okay, if I'm getting rich, and let me say I start making like $20,000 on YouTube. $20,000 to Nigerian currency should be over like $45 million. If I'm getting that type of money, people who are connected to me will not get broke. I don't know if you understand. Okay? So uh, they said, uh, what are the vertebral venous plexus of Batson? And why are they of great importance in understanding the spread of malignancy, prostatic malignancy? It's not only prostatic malignancy. Prostatic malignancy is just one of the infections that could spread through what venous plexus of uh, Batson. Okay. So let's answer this question. You could see this is a venous plexus. This is looking at the top. This is looking at the what? Side view, okay? So you can see the internal vertebral venous plex of Batson. There's a whole interconnection of what? Veins along the spinal cord. You get it. So you see that the venous, uh, the vertebral venous plex of Batson, also known as Batson's plexus, is a network of valveless veins. So you must actually say that what? The veins are valveless. What is the use of a valve in a vein? The valve in the vein will prevent blood from flowing backward. I don't know if you understand. So, one reason is these veins are interconnected a lot. Second reason is they are valveless. So, blood is flowing back and forth, making it easier for infections to spread, like prostatic malignancy. Okay? So, there are a network of valveless veins that connect the deep pelvic veins and the thoracic veins to the internal vertebral venous plexus. Can you see a lot of veins being connected in this stuff, okay? So this plexus runs along the entire length of the vertebral column. And it's significant because it provides a route for the spread of cancer metastasis. Of course, if cancer wants to spread, it just needs to get into just one of the veins and to reach all the other veins, okay? All right, so um, it's, it's provided route for spread of cancer, metastasis, particularly for pelvic organs, like the prostate, okay? So you can see this how a prostate cancer would be like. And most patients that have prostate cancer, before they can be able to ease their self, can you see that the urethra, the prostatic urethra, is squeezed. So before they can ease their self, they have to strain a lot, you get it, all right? So understanding... Uh, uh, what's the importance of this venous plexus in understanding the spread of prostatic malignancy? It is actually a route for metastasis. The Batson's plexus allows cancer cells to bypass the traditional lymphatic system and help them to now spread directly to the vertebral column and other parts of the body. Okay? Mechanism. It is easier for the cancer to spread because there's lack of valves in the vein. Okay? So this means that the blood flow can now move in any direction, okay? So this will actually what facilitate the spread of cancer cells to the distant side, okay? Clinical re relevance, understanding this part will help in diagnosis and help toward treating the metastatic or prosthetic cancer as it provides insight on how the cancer cells can spread and go to other places, okay? So that's it for the vertebral, vertebral venous plates of Batson and the importance in understanding the spread of what prostatic cancer.